Hi guys, today I want to show you the inside of this Kobo 24 volt batteries. Without future ado, let's get started. So, this is a kind of new uh, 4 amp hour battery. It's uh, bigger than the old one. And uh, it's pretty easy to open, it's only 4 screws. So already unscrew those and uh, let's open it up. <laughs> so yeah, this is inside. Yes, it's pretty simple. I mean, you just unscrew this four screw. You can just simply open it up and you can take off the seals. Yeah, there's the seals inside right here. Uh, so the first thing you're gonna notice this is a different cell. Yeah, if you can see the clearly, let's see here. Yeah, this is a Samsung two one seven zero zero cell. So uh, it's not a. This is a much different than the old one. So this is the standard one a six five zero cell. I mean, this is a kind of old standard. Uh, so this is a this this cell uh, two one seven zero zero. This is kind of new standard. I think uh, you know pretty much all the power to the batteries will move up to this kind of cell later on. Uh huh. So it's much bigger. You can you can compare the size. Almost, I will say almost double the size of this uh, one a six five zero for the new cell. You can see, yeah, it close to the double size of that. Uh -huh. um, so you can see, so this is a this is a twenty four volt four amp power. Which means it's a six cell serial link together. Each cell is four amp hour. So you can see this is a big cell is only four amp hours. And uh, when you look at the online for the battery cells, like uh, on eBay, there's uh, the one a six five battery cell. The list of four amp hour, five amp hour, five amp hour is very commonly <laughs> listed on the eBay. But uh, you can see clearly there's no way to make this small cell to a four amp hour or five amp hour. Otherwise, they don't really need to, you know, gather that kind of big cell to make a four amp hour, right? So. Whenever you see that the one a six five zero cell, if they lease like a four amp hour or five amp hour, more likely it's fixed. It definitely don't have such capability to uh, make such small cell in big power. So uh, yeah, that's the things you got to remember. So like uh, this is the old combo. 80 volt battery is only two amp hour, so which means they use this this uh, one a uh, six five zero cell, and the twenty of the, this cell inside, and uh, make a serial link together. So each cell is only two amp hours. Okay, uh, I have a review for this kind of battery. If you want to uh, look, just look on my uh, video, you will find it. Uh, yeah, that's that's the things. Whenever you see the people lease this uh, one eight five zero cell for four amp hour or five amp hour, more likely it's fixed. For this kind of cell, probably the maximum will be three amp hour. Mm -hmm. I will see. Okay. Okay, this is a new cell. With uh, six seal linked together, make a 24 volt. And uh, 
it's basically a small balance board and uh, this is a, a you know indicator power indicator and also there have a little fuse right here uh, let's see what's what's the size of the fuel if you can see from here uh, probably not <laughs> it's a 80 amp fuse 80 amp fuse I mean <laughs> this, this is kind of joking I mean for this sales there's no way to provide 80 amp in the current for those kind of sales I will say the maximum current probably 2 amp 20 amp and they put a 80 amp fuse right here which means you have no way to break this fuse unless you burn off the whole batteries <laughs> okay <laughs> so yeah that's kind of joke they don't have any protections but usually they don't want to put a you know a right size of the fuse because whenever you break the fuse it, it will confuse for you i mean it, it feel like a so you think about if if you have the battery and you do the whole work and suddenly the the no more power <laughs> you will confuse the battery just suddenly just died right but more likely it just uh, feels broken so so that's why most times those kind of company don't want to uh, give you right right size of the field so but uh yeah like a regular use i mean those kind of power tools there's uh, no way to uh you know break your batteries so that's why uh, it's not really something important okay and also let's talk about you know when you do the so this is a this is a quite standard for your handhold uh, setup right so think about why the handhold setup don't don't have 80 volt uh, so you think about so this is 80 volt <laughs> you put 80 volt battery like this right here that's that's too much right it's too big because uh, uh, whenever you want to get 80 volt you have at least serial link 20 of this cell inside to make 80 volt so which which means this this size of the 80 volt battery probably the minimum size that's why you don't see any uh, handhold tool has uh, 80 volt in the power because uh, it, it just <laughs> it just don't make any sense you know hold such battery to work right <laughs> okay yeah <laughs> that's the deal and uh, I also made a you know adapter for this uh, couple of 24 volt batteries. So this is a kind of my new standard uh, battery adapters. So I try to make uh, my adapter is more standard, you know, more same looking to uh, to identify this is my my <laughs> adapter, right? <laughs> So this kind of standard, cause cause you think about the the most of the power tool is just uh, look like this, right? Just look like this. This this kind of shape, right? And you just slide in. Um, so so this is a Walmart brand hyper top, uh, twenty volt. So okay so that's why i want to make a my adapter is more standard as well so right now this adapter I'm, i i uh, i put a three uh hole three mounting hole right here so you can uh you know easily to for your product so let's say if you want to mount the adapter right here so you can just do a three uh screw you it will mount right here and then you can just you know slide in your batteries so if you can 
can just slide in your batteries like this so you will hold strong right here okay so you can mount like this you know you will hold right here so so this become my uh, you know standard shape of my uh, power tool adapters so if I want to change uh, to this uh, you know 20 volt like a like adapter to phase this 20 volt I just uh, make the terminal to fit on here and make uh, the slot to fit on this slot so just a little change to fit a you know different brand you can see the difference between this so this is a Cobo 24 volt adapter and this is a 20 volt battery adapter so basically I just move something uh, you know bigger smaller to fit the different batteries it's all come with standard three hole to uh, mount on your product so makes things much easier so this is a become my new standard okay I uh, will change most of my uh, adapter in this shape so make more identical okay <laughs> okay yeah that's uh today's topic cobble 24 24 volt battery okay yeah if you got any question just let me know leave a comment below okay we'll see you next time